Good day guys, Daniel again here from Gardenscape Design. The other day I was doing a video and I was explaining as to how we could actually use stones to color the underside of your bromeliad leaves. Now you remember when we were smaller guys, um, folks would tell us to put on white or put on something light color and you'll feel more cool. And if it is you use dark colors, you're going to feel more warm. So look at this dark aggregate, the black, the brown, these are just mixed stones here. These would absorb the light and turn it to heat. So it would raise the temperature of the stones. So if it is that you have this close to your plant, this material, or if it is that it's right underneath your plant in the plant pot and it's very hot, it will have a tendency to burn the underside of the leaf. Not all the time, but it will have a tendency to burn the underside of the leaf. Whereas white, white usually reflects light. It don't absorb as much heat and it don't get super hot. So white stones is something that you could actually use uh, between the bromeliads. Um, let's just say if it is you're in the outside open landscape, you could use it there. If it's in the greenhouse and you still have some shade coming in, light will still um, be reflected from the white stones as well to color the underside of your leaf. With regards to freezers, freezers are extremely beautiful and very exotic. So like in the case of these hybrids, you would have a nice color on the top and at the side you would have a different color. Now this have a very slight pink hue. So if it is I use white stones at the base of this, it could actually have to reflect light to give underneath here more color. And this is what I love with freezers. These are a very exotic, beautiful plants. So you could enjoy it from different angles. On the top angle, look at the, on the bottom angle. This one is called white lightning. It's a hybrid white lightning. Add this to your wish list, guys. These are extreme rare plants, wish list plants that you should add. This one is white lightning. This one is called Hawaiian goddess. Now look at how beautiful this plant is. You have some lovely pinks, some green glyphs running through the plant, some longitudinal lines, a lot of character. So it's white on top, and at the underside, you're going to see a bright, lovely pink. These plants get to about three feet wide, so they are usually larger than yours. Varicia is a variety that grows larger than yours. That is why they cross it several times with alcantarias to get massive plants. Look how beautiful this plant is. So using the white stones, you're going to be able to intensify the color underneath this leaf. Look at this beauty here. Some nice glyphs passing through the leaf. And then you have the longitudinal lines, some light longitudinal lines. Green and... Um, dark green light green and you'll see little blushes of pink but look at underneath the, on the side of the leaf on the under leaf on the reverse side of the leaf look how beautiful that is with that pink there so these plants you could put them on a pedestal and you could enjoy them at multiple different angles two collector pieces very rare hard to get pieces and these will look brilliant in your garden guys we're gonna have a lovely release coming out soon. We're going to tell you much more about it as we go along. We're going to show you some pics of what it is we actually would have in store for you guys. Um, the release date to be announced. Beautiful. The name of our collection, All Eyes On Me. Not me. I not so pretty. All Eyes On These Beautiful Plants. These beautiful plants is going to actually some, bring some joy to you guys. And we're going to be growing them together. So stay tuned to our videos. Stay tuned to our posts. And be safe guys. Be blessed. Daniel here from Garden Key Design.